Hello everyone and welcome to the Fry Smiles Oral Health Network. I am your host, Scott Fry, and today in the show we're continuing on with our conversation about tea and tooth staining. Now, many of you more sophisticated tea drinkers out there are probably using simple tea leaves loose to brew your particular cup of tea. Now, many of you probably aren't aware of the fact that there is, in fact, a significant difference in the number of staining molecules in a cup of tea, whether it was brewed using tea in a bag or loose tea leaves. Now, you can probably imagine that the loose tea leaves do, in fact, release more staining molecules into the tea. And this effect is actually more pronounced, the difference between using a tea filter or just loose tea leaves is more pronounced with green tea than with black tea. With green tea, you're going to see about a 50% reduction in the number of staining molecules if you choose to use a paper filter. Then with black tea, you're going to have a much smaller decrease, but still a little bit of a reduction in the number of staining molecules. So if you out there are particularly concerned about tooth staining from tea, I'd suggest going ahead and picking up some paper filters to go ahead and brew your particular brew of tea. So take care everyone and I'll see you next week when we're going to be talking more about tea and Tuesday.